Hold it! I am Miles Edgeworth! Arrest me! <laughs> Why do I feel like I just woke up from a horrible nightmare? Is this an airplane? <laughs> Holy <laughs> Is there an elevator in this airplane? <laughs> what is this? A sinister looking figure on the floor here? That's the body, Mr. Edgeworth. During that interval, the only person in the lounge was myself, which would make me the prime suspect. However, since I did not kill Mr. Hicks, it means the killer was around somewhere. The killer is a human being, unless it's that cat. It's a human or a cat. I, buddy, I think you might have a problem. They're a little smudged, but I think we can both agree they're a set of footprints. Humans use these so we can finally rule out that cat. Unless they were wearing shoes like Puss in Boots. Mr. LeBlanc's conclusions seem to make logical sense, but what if the killer was Puss in Boots? Oh, who is this? Oh, is this a sleepy, cute, blonde stewardess? I hope she's the murderer so I get to talk to her more. Oh, that's your face, huh? Oh man, she's a One Piece character. <laughs> she just, she looks blitzed out of her mind. <laughs> oh man, we have a discount on the world's ugliest suitcase. Tee it really is pretty horrible, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I really like this. You want to know something? This suitcase was designed by Miss Rhoda. Whoa, wouldn't it be crazy if I framed her? I mean, she did the murder. Her name is Francisca I know all this She's a Don't you try to flatter me, Miles Edgeworth. I'm placing you under arrest. You're such a already. Wait, wait, this has all been a big misunderstanding. I didn't kill the victim. A misunderstanding? Those never happen in Ace Attorney. I never thought I'd see the day when a disciple of the House of Von... Uh, oh, hang on. <laughs> Wait a second. The killer used one of your beloved suitcases to move the victim's body. After all, no one would ever find it because no one would ever purchase the suitcase. Oh, a smuggling ring. What were they smuggling? Ugly suitcases. Full of a drug that makes you very sleepy. Mm, I don't know anyone like that. I guess the killer got away. Foolish reasoning for a foolish fool from a foolishly foolish fool meant to fool me. What do you mean by I don't have any evidence to show? Perhaps I should have phrased it as that which caused Agent Hicks' death is incorporeal. What? It was a ghost! <laughs> I wonder if you'd be so kind as to take a look at this receipt, Miss Meal? Huh? A receipt? For what? It's for the suitcase Miss Teniro bought. That's... I call on that evidence. No one would buy one of those suitcases. It has to be fake. So, Miss Meal, where were you really between the hours of 5 and 6 a.m.? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, the bathroom? I'll be the judge of that. Examine the toilets. I don't have any actual evidence. I thought not. But that's because it went missing. And still is. Missing? What do you mean by that? Missing, it means things are gone when you're looking for them. <laughs> Shut up, Edsbert. <laughs> Francisca, I'd like to ask for your assistance. Your Franciscans, if you won't mind. Shut up, Edsbert. No! <laughs> <laughs> well, that flight sucked. One star. I'm, I'm mostly enjoying this game so far. It is time for the Scooby-Doo adventure. What? <laughs> Holy Sorry, but I just stole your supporting role. Oh man, that's that's a little too on the nose. You enjoying Kay? No. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> well, I guess it's fine. She's dead now. Agent Long knew about Lang Long. I'll probably- I'll just change it every time. Agent Lasagna. Linguini. Agent Luigi definitely has an agenda. And why? Why do I feel such an intense loathing emanating from him? That's just my natural dog, Musk. 
two people missing and two kidnappers. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Refresh my memory. Uh, what kind of person is Lance again? Bipedal? <laughs> what are we thinking? <laughs> Look, there's a blurb about the cactus here. This cactus is a very gracious gift to Gatewaterland from the local police precinct. I can't believe the police went so far as to even donate a cactus to this place! So is the police department running a cactus farm on the side? Haha, <laughs> just kidding. What a funny joke. Aw, oh, and I was hoping I'd get to ride one. You know how to ride a horse? Nope, never rode one in my life. But I have an Asian friend who was born in the year of the horse. What? What? Maybe we'll find the kidnappers hiding inside. Hold up, I'm eating Chinese food. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. why are you- Get the body out of your mouth! Kay sure likes flesh! I have nothing to hide, Agent Ladder. Agent L'Oreal! Licorice Z says, <laughs> Every pack has its own rule. <laughs> <laughs> I already looked into everyone else here. Said that I just pictured him like clawing open their guts and be like, No crime in here. Why does he look so sickly pale all of a sudden? Gun! <laughs> Can you try to calm down and lower your voice to a more reasonable level, officer? No! But the only people that seem to gather around me were little girls, sir! I okay, wait, hang on. I thought I had no choice at that point, sir, so I pulled my gun on them! To be frank. I'm just a little man. I'm just a little <laughs> man, sir. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, Agent Lickertongue, Agent Lovecraft, Agent Littlefoot, wait! <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth. Yes, Kay. There's something even thieves would never steal. Do you know what that is? A lobster. Badger, 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 badger. Mushroom, mushroom, mushroom. <laughs> yeah! Agent Listener. I'm terribly sorry, Agent Lesbian. Z says. Ah! Right now, I imagine the two kidnappers are Lance himself and the butler, and he murdered the butler for some reason. All right, I give up. I abducted myself. Lance. The fact that random blushy blushy girl so pointedly was like, I wouldn't even recognize my dad if I met him again, means he's definitely also going to be a character who's alive. Or dead if he was the butler. What is it? Is it that he's secretly her dad? I'm so far ahead of this case that like I don't know what I need to present in what order. <laughs> is it her th the necklace? No, I'm sorry. That wasn't right either. It's the other pendant, which then allows you to show the first pendant that I showed. Don't you understand? And it's these two pieces of evidence, which must be presented in this order! Glad I looked this up. I can't wait until this random Civ Lady extra turns out to be a villain. Oh, Sheena? Yeah. <laughs> I look like I'm made of dough! Now hold on there, Miss Pops. I know a little bit about being framed for shooting my own father. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I love an Ace Attorney whenever people are like nonchalantly pointed at me with his right hand. You know how like no one ever talks. Yeah, like you picked up on that. Yeah, sure. Oh, right. This is the icon for the victim's costume. I was looking for the actual costume, not the stupid head. There's two bad badger heads for different bad badger costumes with different artwork. Boy, this case is still going, huh? Is there anything in the hallway that could have been used as a weapon? Like a gun. Like a like sword? A gun. Like a conspicuous <laughs> sword sticking out of the ground? <laughs> it was me! I hit you! Alright, so it's you then. Is there a copy of the Haunted House's blueprints among the police's reference documents? Why would we have that? Yeah, we got it. If the criminal couldn't even hide himself in the hallway, how could he hide a giant doll? By putting it in another room? What? I don't- I actually There's don't- There's more under than one room. I don't understand! And no. Lance just admitted that he hit him in the head! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this case sucks. I don't know, were they like reflecting a badger from somewhere else like it's an episode of Magic School Bus? I'm gonna- if it's just like this was a reflected badge. <laughs> what do you. What do you mean? 
What do you mean the building layout was wrong? We're looking at the blueprints! I'm just gonna look it up. I'm done with this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Well, I'm glad we're back to proving the thing he already admitted. Oh, man. This game's losing me real fast. I'm sorry. <laughs> Detective like Gumshoe today sucked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, wait, are we actually going back in time again? That such a legendary prosecutor is watching over and judging my performance. I'll have to be perfect in every way. <laughs> On karma, I found something weird. Even more outrageous is his claim that the case... <laughs> yeah, I did it. What are you gonna do? <laughs> I've secured an hour of recess for you to prepare to do just that. I shall go on the monkey bars. The... <sighs> the victim, Mr. <laughs> Dade Man. Take a look at these documents. Sir, this is just a letter saying I hate you over and over. Slap, slap, slap. Look at it closer, Edgeworth. Criminals have a way of incriminating themselves, wouldn't you say? Ooh, my shoulder hurts. <laughs> <laughs> there shall be no yelling in this sacred hall of law. Oh man, you know who'd be great at this character is Glass. No one's allowed on the crime scene, period. <laughs> I'll have you know, madam, that I studied under Manfred von Karma. He threatens to murder me every day. <laughs> like that! <laughs> Do not take me for some naive novice. You whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Do not take me for some naive novice. <laughs> By the way, do you know who I am? My name is Callisto Yu. I hope you're the murderer. <laughs> like... Fine, let's go. Oh boy. <laughs> it's the crime scene where a detective is most useful and effective. Hmm. It's not like I don't know that. Writes that down. Shit, I'm. Le leans over to Edgeworth. What's a detective? Papa, are you really assigning Miles Edgeworth to cover the case? Yes, I am. Why do you ask? Why do I have an accent and you don't? I consumed my accent for its power. Detective Bad, may I have a word with you? No, what is it? It appears that both a knife and a gun were used as murder weapons. Yeah. <laughs> That leads us to our first question of the investigation. What were they killed with? Don't you find it odd that the left-handed Mr. Faraday would hold the gun in his right hand? What a novel contradiction! I bet no other case in this series has ever used that. <laughs> Nonchalantly pointed at me with his right hand! Recall Detective Gumshoe's testimony! I was in the hallway the whole time. But I didn't hear a single peep of a struggle. Remember how he said that in orange? Might you be hiding something from me? Yeah, I'm hiding one thing. Opens jacket, reveals pigeon with a small hat. Maybe you're not such a bad guy after all. Don't get ahead of yourself, I'm a terrible guy. I've heard that people have been calling it the second KG-8 incident. Only among you law enforcement types. You're a... What? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> aren't you a lawyer? <laughs> Here I come! Bunum, 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 bunum. For your money! Bunum, bunum, bunum. <laughs> I suspect what we're missing is hidden right here in this crime scene somewhere. Justice! Eh, eh. <laughs> Sir, please let me go! You and I, the girl, we were in the lobby number one next door. Wait, I'm confused. W when was I with you? No, not you. You. Yes, me. He no. means you. No, not you. You. I don't... I was never in the hallway, detective. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Running towards lobby number two, together with you. I wasn't there. How much time elapsed between you and me? Oh. oh. Defendant's fresh milk? Oh. 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 Courthouse special Swiss rolls. This is being sold somewhere on the premises. Miles, are you an idiot? Well, then where do they sell these things, huh? It's a mystery. Um, we'll never find out. Dirk, where in the world did this come from? <laughs> Am I really going to have to deduce that this Swiss roll came from this vending machine? Are you kidding me? Eureka! Eureka!
Eureka! <laughs> Eureka! Francisco! <laughs> well, all I see is a piece of garbage, and it is not just you, Miles Edwell. That is quite rude, Francisco! Uh, it's not like it was I who littered! <laughs> rubbish belongs in a rubbish bin! Open up, Edgeworth! <gasps> Detective Gumshoe must have sat on this bench as he ate a Swiss roll. We've got our killer. <laughs> as he ate, he developed telekinesis. Mr. Edward, please allow me to testify to the court one more time! You made him feel very old, didn't you? Just keep on talking. He's keeping it, but scoop, stop, stop. Now that he mentions it, right before we started the trial, he did talk about that. I didn't think I'd be talking this long. Your Honor, about what you just said. I know. I couldn't believe it myself, but he was banging her gunshot and then I heard a teacher guy and I jumped and I pulled it like this and you see it. This, ah! Your Honor, please remain <laughs> calm when you're trying to explain yourself to me. Unfortunately, Your Honor, this is what really produced the gunshot that you heard. A gun. <laughs> I'm not a you, I'm a K! No, you is the other person. Now then, K. <laughs> Faraday, you and I. Me? As you already know, even I was supposed to protect them. Oh, I got pizza. Oh, oh I got that's pizza. fine. I can't oh. listen to our sad backstory. Miles. Oh, mm, this is really good pizza. Shame you can't have any since you're sad. Sorry, couldn't help but notice that you're crying over the phone there. Can't deliver your pizza. Sorry, you'll have to call back when you're happier, yes. Just saying you're sorry won't bring my sister back, she said. <laughs> spot on. I wanted to be an actor, anyways. Well, what happened about that? Tell me more of your sad backstory while I eat just pizza. That's and where the other half of the bullet holes came from. Next question. My pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Edgeworth? Yes? His honor would like to transfer It will always seem grandiose. Speaking of grandiose, I'd say that ego of yours could use a little deflating. I was in lobby number one, talking with you. No, you weren't. Not I was you. somewhere yeah. else. I'll kill you. Why? Why She's would you kill her? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now then, what else besides a smell can go both in and out of an open, barred window? The answer is sound! That's right, it's mine. And I received it from Dr. Dr. Bad, I guess now. <laughs> I have a PhD in bullets. Hey, Edgeworth. Did you know the Yaragarasu has three legs? Hmm. Do you know where that is? It means that the Yaragarasu has more than one razor-sharp way to do her work. Whoa! Where did Kay go? Oh, that's a gunshot. <laughs> you don't believe me? It wasn't just the expression on my face. I clearly said it was impossible just now. All right then, how do you explain this? I'll recreate my father! And if you are plotting to commit a crime, then I'm afraid I can't be complicit. Mr. Edgeworth? Ooh. You guys, you're <laughs> easy for me. Who am I supposed to support now? Mr. Edgeworth. Oh, okay, I'll support him then. What I want is the arrest of that evil woman. That evil woman? You mean Callisto you? No, I meant Francisca von Karma. Also acceptable, I agree. Come to think of it, I do believe I owe you. Huh? Owe me for what? That kick in the shorts, yeah! <laughs> Yeah, no, I've heard the I've heard the last case is like bonkers long.